Hi guys, it's Tasha. I wanted to share with you my very first loaded mini envelope and I followed a tutorial that was done by Miss Tamika from Scrap the World. Hey girl, thank you so much for the tutorial. You know your sister needs it. And this is for a friend of mine. She and I used to work together and I used to always, well I still do, create little crafty things for my co-workers and she mentioned on her Facebook page she and I were having a discussion and she said that she kind of missed me giving her little things like this but you know it was never this elaborate just little stuff and so I you know told her that I would you know see what I can do for February so this is her gift and actually her birthday is this month please don't ask me what day it is but it's somewhere around Valentine's Day which is over of course but I'm gonna send this to her anyway and I'm gonna go through it and I put these clips on right here and I got these the idea for these clips from favored faves I think or favorite favors or something along I can never remember her name but this is where this the inspiration for this clip comes from and the clip back here and I really don't want to take this thing apart but I'm probably gonna wind up doing that so then that's that one and I made two heart clips out of the scatters that you get from Dollar Tree. So I just made two heart clips from there. This is a, oh, I didn't know I even had, forgot I put those little thingies down. There's some little, little sachet pockets or whatever they are, little satin pockets. Let me have satin pockets, little satin hearts. And must be some, was it just that one down in there? No, it's a, it's, I see another one, a couple, there's a few in there. But these right here are just little cards, and I put a little washi tape right there, and it's got a bag of tea in that one. That one, and this one has a bag of tea, and this one has actually come loose. That's a bag of tea in there as well. And I just put this little Project Life card on there. It says, Open Your Heart. And this doily is actually semi-stuck to the back of this thing here. And there's some more little hearts down in there. Let me put these back right quick. Mm -hmm. I won't take too much time because I don't want you guys to get too bored. And let me just stop right there. And then I got these clips. I got a pack, maybe two packs of these clips from Dollar Tree. And I just had a, uh, what is this thing? I just tied one of these things to it. A tassel. Whew, have mercy. And it's going to just be hanging on the side right here. It's just going to be hanging right there. And I put another tea bag of tea right here. Some lemon ginger. And I hope she likes tea. Have mercy. If she don't, we. I put this little heart note card. I put a bag of gel pens. I got it going at an angle. I'm sorry. Bag of gel pens. I made this wand. And I need to actually do a little bit more securing to it to the back. But this is the wand. I put two of these little game books back here. Mm. My two little game books. I, I think these were at Walmart. And I just made a tag and there's nothing on it, just a blank tag. And I've put this little thing with the twirlies. And she'll pull them out, this little straw, if she feels like it. And I have little paper scatters or paper stuffings or whatever in there. And this little cute little rabbit pa um, Prince paper clip clothespin that was a gift. And that is my first loaded mini envelope from a tutorial from Miss Tamika from Scrap the World. Thank you guys for joining me and I'm going to put this back together. Have a good night. Bye bye. And you know what guys I forgot to tell you about finish telling you about this. I'm going to put this on the back of it so that she can sit it up somewhere hopefully on her desk if she likes it enough. Who was it? That's Shantae. I think she did a video 
and she showed how to use this and when I bought this I just really didn't know because it came in a, a lot so I'm so glad I held on to it and did not sell it so I'm going to cut one of these tonight I'm going to fix it to the back of here so that it'll stand hopefully it'll stand on her desk or wherever she chooses to put it because she's not a crafter I don't think she is she's an artist she, well, she used to um, draw and stuff but I don't know if she still does it or not but I want it to stand so hopefully it'll work out that way alright guys that's it for real this time bye bye